I was there. Me. I was a resident of Bethlehem, a rather prominent businessman. Yes, I'm the innkeeper, the bad guy of the Christmas story. But give me a little credit. At least the stable had hay to soften the floor because I was long ago out of mattresses in the inn. Anyway, I was busy. The place was full. I mean, what's a guy supposed to do? Business was booming. Everything was going crazy. Not a vacancy in sight. The place was filled to overflowing. It was such a crazy night. When I heard somebody knocking persistently upon my door. And a man said, please forgive me. Do you have room for just two? I mean three more. One look at his face and a glimpse of his not-so-tiny wife let me know that this guy really needed a room. But I didn't have one. Then, I had an idea. I looked at the young man and made him my very best offer. Everything's been going crazy. Everything's been going crazy. As you can see, the place is full. As you can see, the place is full. The only space that I can give you. The only space that I can give you. Is where we keep the animals. Is where we keep the animals. And though it's really not the best place. And though it's really not the best place. It's better than the open air. Better, better. And if you think that it will suit you. I'll have somebody meet you there. He said, oh, yes, sir. I mean, thank you. So I sent word to the stable boy to get everything ready. I smiled reassuringly and said, if you need anything, just let the stable boy know. And then I locked the doors and windows. Locked the doors and all the windows. And went upstairs to get some sleep. Went upstairs to get some sleep. But all my mind could do was wonder. All my mind could do was wonder. If they were bothered by the sheep. Were they bothered by the sheep? And then I looked out of my window. And saw a bright and shining star. I saw some shepherds at the stable and wise men coming from afar. I had the strange sense that something wonderful was taking place. Then the light, it was so bright, it was blinding. And at that moment, something told me that everything that I had seen was something extraordinary, just like the birthday of a king. And as I tried to comprehend it, a dreadful thought ran through my head. Do you think? No. Could I have the star, the wise men, shepherds? Oh, no. Could I? Nah. I guess I'll never understand it. Guess I'll never understand it. For the rest of my life. For the rest of my life. I know I never will forget it. I know I never will forget it. All that happened on that night.